God, because of what God has been doing this week in the school of the seer, in the grace encounter, God has been doing great things in this ministry. Until this morning, I saw an angel called Restoration. Today, I will preach a message about the restoration. And God said to me, I'm sending to this the angel of restoration. He, and I saw that angel. She, he had different anointing he was carrying for these vows. And I started writing the things that I saw. They were in the body of this angel. There were many, but I picked ten of them that I will talk today about the angel of the restoration. Before we do that, if there is a church to pray, higher, if there is a church to pray, if there is a lawyer to pray, if there is a woman like this one can pray, rise up with your feet, we make a prayer in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We must make a prayer. I love that. If you see me, run away because I will tell you to be pray. That is what I can never forget. It's a covenant I have in God. Uh -huh. Eric, uh, Judges, uh -huh. Joshua chapter 7, verse 25. Joshua chapter 7, verse 25. Joshua, uh -huh. Joshua uh -huh. chapter 7, verse 35, 25. And Joshua said, This is Joshua, and Joshua said these are words. This is a story of Achan. Uh -huh. And Joshua said, Why hast thou troubled us? Why, you, you, Akan, you have troubled us? The Lord shall trouble thee this day. The Lord shall trouble you this day. And all Israel stoned. And all Israel, they stoned Akan. I and wanted to pick a prayer point there. Trouble. Why do you trouble us? Joshua said, Why have you troubled us? May the Lord trouble you. May the Lord trouble you. Are you listening? May the Lord trouble you. May the who? Today, I wanted we pray a prayer. Anybody that has been troubling me, may the Lord trouble you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Are you serious? Are you okay? Are you troubling me? Take care in this prayer. Take care for this prayer. Anybody who is, has been troubling me, I wanted we start with. We will pray this prayer today. If there is no any other prayer, we pray. We can pray this prayer and we go home. We can pray this prayer and we go home. I wanted we tell the ones who have. I want to give you a story. Two weeks ago, a friend of mine, I'm a cook in Noma TV, television. Zikifika kwa nyumba zinaungua. Any electrical thing inaungua. Antina nangalia baka wiring inaungua. He came to me and, asked, and told me, Moses, I don't know what is happening in my house. Nika muambia, omba ima ombi. Because me, I do not know. Najua, TV kuungua shi shetani. Apo ndu nilianzia. Nika muambia, TV kuungua, I don't have an answer. Ikaungua ya kwanza. Nika muambia, uskajari, ende wangalie kama ni soketi zako, what is electricity naenda aje. Aka nimbia wacha TV, baka fridge, baka pasi. Nika muambia, something is wrong. Nika muambia, go and pray this prayer. What happened? She was living with a woman in that house, a house girl. When she prayed this prayer, this girl, iyo siku wakasema anaenda. Eh, anataka kutoka aende. Haka mushika. Aliposhika huyo mushana, venyo, ni bibi yake, bibi yake kasema, this girl, haizi yenda baka tucheki bagi yake, tujuka mamebaba vitu zetu. Unajua lipata nini? Alipata huyu mwanamuke, huyu mushana, anapicha baka za mtoto wake, na amewakata ame kichwa. Amekata hizo picha kichwa. Amekata hizo picha kichwa. He? Ilikuwa drama movie. Ilikuwa kwa episode. Kwa hiyo nyumba. Ilikuwa movie. Because this is a woman, this is a girl has been troubling this house. Because she has been going to the witches. She has been being used by another woman who has been fighting this family. Kumubebe hizo vitu. Anapeleka. Hey! Today, whoever has been troubling me, 
May the Lord trouble you. Whoever has been troubling my finances, may the Lord trouble you. Open up your mouth in the name of Jesus. Release yourself tonight. Release yourself. Uh, whoever has been troubling me, whoever shall be troubling me, may the Lord trouble you today in the name of Jesus. Any man, any woman uh, that has been troubling uh, my finances, oh, I, this is my prayer. This is my prayer. This is my prayer. This is our prayer. This is our prayer. As a kima, whoever has been troubling, and I send uh, the trouble, the troubles of God, uh, I send uh, the angels uh, that they will trouble you, whoever has been troubling uh, my, ma my marriage, uh, oh God, uh, whoever has been troubling uh, in, in his mind, uh, in his heart, uh, oh God, uh, arise my God, uh, arise oh God, uh, arise oh God, uh, arise oh God, uh, arise oh God, uh, Arise, oh Father, arise today, arise, 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 oh Father, in the name of Jesus, arise, oh God, whoever has been tabering her, oh today, 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 trouble them, in Jesus' name, we have prayed, I repeat again, I am a suspect, in Jesus' name we have prayed. Achan was among the children. But Joshua said, Why have you troubled us? The Lord shall trouble you this day. We are living in the days. Listen, this is a couple. The enemy was trying to trouble them. I did not know. Then God whispered to me the story of Achai. People that they trouble you, they are not far. They are close to you. They are very No one can trouble you that does not know you. People that troubles you are people closer to you. When God then spoke to me, son, help this man. Let him pray this prayer. And there was a result. I wanted we pray this prayer. I wanted we pray to you, look to your hands like this one. This year, no one will trouble your finances, your business, your career. No one will trouble. Open your mouth in the name of Jesus. Speak to those hands uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, oh God, you have given me. You have given me finances. You have given me finances. Uh, you have given me. You have given me ideas, oh God. Uh, you have given me strategies, oh God, to make way of the oh God. Uh, Father, oh God, this is my prayer. This is our prayer. This is our prayer. This is our prayer today. This is our prayer. This is our prayer. Oh God, uh, this is our prayer. This is our prayer. Oh God, uh, this is our prayer. Oh God, uh, this is our prayer today. This is our prayer in the name of Jesus. This is our prayer. This is our prayer. Oh God, oh God, this is our prayer. No one will trouble us. No one will trouble my finances. I decree in this economy. No one will trouble my finances. No one will trouble my economy, my bank account. No one will trouble. Oh God Almighty, oh Jehovah, the systems of my world my finances uh, in the name of jesus no one will trouble my company no one will trouble what god you have called me to do oh god my agro business no one will, will trouble in the name of jesus anything that you have given me to do no one will trouble in jesus name we are prayed psalm, one, psalm 119 psalm 119 162 psalm 119 162. I wanted to show you. Yeah. Psalm 119. 162. Wait for me. I rejoice at thy word. I rejoice at thy your word. Uh -huh. As one, that As one has found great spoil. spoil. I rejoice for your word. As one has found it what? Are you looking for the spoil? Yes. Then take the word of God yes. and you will get the great spoil. Amen. 
I wanted to tell God, God, give me your word so that I may rejoice. Like someone has get, someone, like someone has received a great spoil. Oh God, give me that word that will cause me to rejoice. Like someone has founded great spoil. Open your mouth in the name of Jesus. Release a prophetic word. Release that prophetic word. Oh God, oh God, may it cause me to rejoice because of your word. This year, oh God, this week, this day, oh God, oh God, give me, give me that joy through your word. Give me that joy through you, that word, oh God, as well. Anna has founded great, great spoils. Oh God Almighty. Oh God. This is my prayer. 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 Oh God. Give me that word that will cause me to rejoice. Oh God. For the great spoiler. Like someone has founded great spoiler. Oh God Almighty. In the marketplace. Oh God. Oh God. Give me that word. Give me that word. Oh God. Give me that word give me that word oh god let me rejoice at your word today like someone who has founded a great spoiler oh god oh god oh god of mercy oh god of mercy let me today let me today oh god oh god let me today rejoice oh god let me rejoice at your word today like someone who has founded a great spoiler a great spoiler this year this week in the name of jesus this month of god oh god have mercy have mercy in jesus name we have prayed stick to god stick to god Open your ma mouth and talk to God now. In the name of Jesus. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. This is my prayer. Anything that can take me. My eyes are from you. Take it, it away. Take it away. Take it away. Oh God. Anything wants to steal my eyes. My focus in you. Anything that wants to divert me away from you. Take it away God. I need you God. Than that thing oh God. I need you, God, because the earth and its fullness belongs to you, God. Stick me my eyes to you. Oh, God, hold me, God. Hold me tight, oh, God. Hold me tight, oh, Jehovah. Oh, God, hold me tighter. Hold me tighter. Hold me tighter. Hold me tight, oh, God. I beseech you today. I beseech you today in this altar in Hekima. I beseech you. Hold me, God. Hold me, oh, God. Remove everything, God. Can steal my eyes from you. Remove it Oh God, remove it, oh Father, remove it, oh God, remove it, oh God, in the name of Jesus, remove it in Jesus' name. We are praying. Amen. Psalm 63, Psalm 63, verse 1. My kataba has nothing, nothing will steal us. We will remain for God, Amen. we will move for God, Amen. nothing will divert us, nothing will cause us not to see what God is doing. This is why I remember this prayer point. I picked this prayer point. A day I was in Korea. We were talking with Samsung. Samuel and Sam. And I saw them. These people. The prayer point. Because these people. They travel all over the world. They travel all over the world. But ikifika jumapili. Samuel. Nasang, they go back to their churches. Samuel is he is in Korea. He is a keyboardist, Samuel. Sang is an usher in the church. Amen. But these people they travel. See, kama wewe na mimi, uko around. Bado jenda yeshagi, uko around. Now you can never come to church. And today I fought me. I was so tired in the office. What I've been doing. I fought today not to go to church. I sleep. Ambia jirani wako. Watch out, Jinga. I'm getting a Niaka. Watch out, Jinga. I'm getting a Niaka. Watch out, Jinga. Auna Kitu. I'm getting a Niaka. Auna Kitu. I'm getting a Niaka. Auna. Watch out, Jinga. Auna. Auna Kitu. Nameanza Kuringa. Auna. 
Auna. I love this man who do boxing, who you are Philippine. The pastor from the Philippines. This for pastor of the Philippines. Uyu jama me penda mungu atakenda boxing. Eh? Anapigiago anapigiago nyimbo za mungu amazing grace. Wow. Anapigio hakuna mungu kama wewe. Eh? You think because he loves God. The man please auna kitu. Acha kujifanya auna kitu. Eh, auna. Yeah. Hallelujah. Sit down in the right hand of the one who is seated on the throne room of God. Yeah, sit closer to Jesus in the heavenlies. Yeah, sit close to the heavenlies. The glory and the power. You know, these are currencies. You don't need Kenya money. Yeah. Kenya, they are changing money. They, they are, every now they are changing money. Only you need the glory and the power that attracts money. They attract regal tenders. This world is all about regal tender. Money is a regal tender. Yeah. People are ten, you, 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 God can bring people like finances on your way. Don't look only to work on a coin. There are some things other money cannot give you. But they are with people. Be like what you have been saying. A prophet is for what? He's a madman. <laughs> Be like a prophet. <laughs> As a madman. <laughs> You're mad people. I love mad, mad people. They don't, uh, mad people, they are not controlled by the rules and the principles. Uh, uh, madman, akifikiria nanda pandei. Awezi musimamisha. Akisema ni kuklosu barabara. Takai kujua kama ni tract inakuja au ni nani inakuja. We funga break. Lakini mimi ndo napita. A madman atakai kujua where there is a zebra closing. Ati hapa kuna zebra closing, wacha nitafute. Madman ajui. Ata angaliagi look like, look left. Ana pitaga. Enda pale hivi uh, highway, uone. Uh, Uru park. Ana kigunia. Baka polisi ni muangaria. Wale wengine wamesimama madman ajui. Wewe simamisha, simamisha magali na simamisha binadamu. Wale wengine. Mimi niko kazi yangu. Na kifikiria akua katikati ya barara, barabara akae chini na kaa hapo. Change your faith. Change your faith. Change your faith. Give yourself fully to God. What God has said. Pick what God has said. Uh-huh. Season of your restoration is today. Anaske bako wamini. Na nimekwambia kuweka mamad. Mwana wakiri, cha nikupe maji. Yeah, yeah, ndiyo. Cha nikupe maji. Sato kisema ameni, mzuri uteza sikia ni metuwa so. Gresi. Second King chapter 8 verse 3 to 6. Second Kings, chapter 8, 3 to 6. Uh-huh. And it came to pass. It came to pass. At the seventh year. The seven years ends. ends. Uh-huh. That the woman returned. And it came to pass. Uh-huh. That the woman returned out of the land. The woman of the returned back to her land. Out of her, fro- he the returned land of back the to his own land. Uh huh. And she went forth to cry unto the king. She went back to cry for her king. She went back, and she started crying for her king. Uh huh. For her house and for her land. For her house and for her land. Uh huh. And the king talked with Gehazi the servant, the, of the man of God. Was talking. This, this is a man called Gehazi, a man with the reprosy. Already was in the house of the king, but they were talking, discussing with the king. Uh huh. Saying, saying, tell me, I pray thee. This is the king was telling Gehazi. Uh huh. All the great things that Elisha has done. All the great things that Elisha has done. Uh huh. 
And it came to pass, uh-huh. as he was telling the king how he had restored a dead body to life, uh-huh. that behold, the woman whose son he had restored to life. Hey, hey see, Gehazi was giving a testimony mm. of what God did through his, the man of God called Elisha. He was giving a testimony to the king. He was talking to the king what Elisha did. But when they were talking, what happened? Behold, the uh-huh. woman whose son he had restored to life uh-huh. cried to the king for he, her house. He cried to the king for her house. And for her land. Uh-huh. And Gehazi said, uh-huh. My lord, yes. O king, O king, this is the woman. This is a woman. And this is her son. This is her son. Whom Elisha restored to life. Who Elisha has restored. Listen. Uh-huh. Verse 6. And when the king asked the woman, uh-huh. she told him. She told her. So the king appointed unto her a certain officer. The king, up today the Lord must appoint some, an officer for you. Amen. And the king appoint, God is appointing. Amen. Today God is in the work. Are you listening to me, Hekima? Yes. If you can forget all my point, remember God is pointing. God is bringing someone. God is appointing someone for you. And the king appointed an officer. And he said what? Saying, uh, restore say, all that was Restore. Hard. God is appointing someone who will come and assist you for your restoration. Amen. To restore. Uh-huh. And all the fruits. Sorry. Mm. Saying, restore all that was hers. Restore and, what was hers. And all the fruits all of the, the field. All the fruits of the field. Uh-huh. Since the day the that she since left the, the land, the day that she left in the in the land, even, even now. now, amen. Even now, restore to her all the fruits of her field. Amen. Since the day that she left in the land, until now. Restoration. Restoration. Restoration means to bring back. Restoration means to bring back. Restoration means to return back. Restoration means to rebuild back. Restoration means to reconstruct back. Restoration means To renovate back. This is what the king said. May this woman should be restored. All the fruits of her field. Since the day that she left. The land. Imagine even now. I want to go very fast. What I saw in the angel. Who stepped in Hekima. And I saw many things. But I picked ten of them. Out of the body of the angel. Of the restoration. Because you want to restore to us. The things we wasted. The things we left. Many years ago. God wants to give them back to us. Ten things God will restore. Joel chapter 2. Uh, Joel chapter 2 verse 25. Joel 2.25 Restore to us. Uh huh. And I will restore to you the years that Listen, the locusts... I will restore the years that the locusts... The locusts... Uh huh. That the locust has eaten. Uh huh. The canker worm. Ka- the canker worm. The caterpillar. The caterpillars. And the palmer worm. Palmer worm. My great army which I sent among you. See, no matter if it was, it does not matter what happened, but God is at work Amen. to restore you. No matter, no matter, kama ni katapila, kama ni kaka worms, or what, God wants to restore. One of the things God wants to restore, it is Genesis chapter 40, read verse 13. Genesis chapter 40, verse 13. Uh-huh. 
Yet within three days uh -huh. shall Pharaoh lift up thine hand uh -huh. and restore thee and unto restore thy place. The place. And thou shalt deliver Pharaoh's cup into his hand. Uh -huh. After the former manner when thou wast his butler. Uh -huh. Verse 21. Verse 21. Verse 21. I'm, 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 I'm squeeze so that when you go, you will read for yourself. Uh -huh. And he restored the chief and butler. And he restored the chief butler. Unto his butlership. Uh -huh. Again. Uh -huh. And he gave the cup into Pharaoh's hand. Listen, one of the things God wants to restore in your life, it's your position. Amen. God wants to restore the position of this ministry. God wants to restore your position in this life. Bible says, and Pharaoh, he it was a prophetic through Joseph. But this was what the, now the Pharaoh did. He restored the chief butler to his what? Butlership. Uh -huh. Again. And he gave him what? The cup. the cup of who? For Pharaoh's hands. God wants to restore to us our position in this community. Amen. I say, where you lost the position. Amen. May the Lord give you that position back. Amen. Where you lost the position. Yes. In your family. Uh -huh. Nowadays, it's your, and your brothers and your sisters. Your juniors. Uh -huh. Already you lost your position. In that company. People will go to Kuskia. It does not matter. You lost it. But I came to say today, because an angel of, of position is here, he's clothing us back with a place of our position. Amen. Where we'll go back to a place of our position. Amen. This is a man. He was restored back. May the Lord restore you back. Amen. May the Lord restore you back. Amen. May the Lord restore you back. Amen. Where your forces are trying to fight you not to receive. May the Lord restore you back. Amen. May the angel of the position Amen. take you to that place of a position. Amen. Number two. Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 17. Position. I saw position. Exchange for position. Position. God taking you to a place of your position again. Najiko watu mlisoma nao. Mukikutana nao. Position yenye huko. Baka wana kuambi wanuga. Uyu tuko tunasoma na yeye. Unasema yeye. Tuko tunasoma na yeye. Yeah? Because already they are in position. May God you give a position. When they meet you in the next day. In the next minute. Tomorrow Monday. Let them may see another position. That God has shifted you. In the name of Jesus. I came to decree as a prophet. A new position for you. In the name of Jesus. May the Lord take you to a position. Again in the name of Jesus. Where you will gain again. In the name of Jesus. Do it for me my brother. For I will restore health. I will restore thee. what? Health. Health. I will restore health unto thee. I will do what? Restore health. Uh huh. And I will I heal will... thee uh -huh. of thy wounds. Uh huh. Says the Lord. Uh huh. Because they called thee an outcast. Because they have called you an outcast. Uh huh. Saying. You, see, listen, listen. Do you, when you become sick. Admitted in the hospital, people they start calling you an outcast. Ukipata tuka ugonjo kadogo wana kuonaga wewe you are a product, you are a product of the mortuary. You are a product of six by forty or six by seven, six by fourteen. They start seeing you are that one. God say, I will restore your health. No, not not only that, I will heal thee from your wounds. Says the Lord because of what. God have seen people calling you outcast. Number two, I came to prophesy to someone here. God is restoring us our health. Amen. God is restoring in this ministry our health. Amen. Where people, when they will see you, they will see our health. Yes. 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 Umechapana na mafuta imeisha. Ati pasta nano, duku kunaona pasta nano, duku nyalikuwa. Hei ni mina ona squeezy ni mugonjo. Na pasta nano di mafasting. Na stairs zenye ziko hapa zinakulaga mtu. Eh? 
you know when people they see you conclusion yao na kuaga already auna health bible say already people watu wanaanza kukuweka outcast they were your friends wanaanza kukutupa i came to decree today to someone Amen. the angel of the lord said to me yes. i will give them health Some of you you do not know what you are passing in your body but there is a health coming in your body there is a health coming in your body there is a mental health is coming in you in the name of Jesus God is giving you a mental health God is giving you a sight health God is giving you health totally in your body health into your body restoration for your health 